son, Nicky, we borrowed him for this little segment here. You see, our next guest have found a terrific way to turn common household items into children's crafts. That's it's really cool. That's right. They've even written a book about it. It's called The Ultimate Book of Kid Concoctions. Will you please welcome John Thomas and Anita Pagel. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Appreciate it. How are you? How are you? Welcome to the show. Thanks so much. Nikki's going to help us here. Hi, Nikki. Now, first of all, I have to say that I actually have this book at home. My kids love it. Oh, thank you. How, what inspired you to come up with the idea for this book? Well, actually, I ran across this right here, which was a 1950s college experiment that demonstrated how two liquids turn into a solid. And we added a little color to it and just kind of played with the proportions. And it's virtually identical to something that they sell in the store for about $5. And we show you how to make 20 ounces of it at home for 30 cents. And this is so that was like the See, that's what I love about this book is, oh, this is so economical. Should Most of these it? things you're going to sure, show us today it. is what? How, what, a dollar? Under a dollar. Under a dollar. Everything. Okay. Everything is under a dollar. And besides that, you know, they're, they're fun to buy for kids, but I think it's more fun for the kid to make it. Oh, right. Sure okay, it is. Nikki, let's make you want to have some fun here? Okay, okay let's start right. right over here with treasure stones. If everybody wants to grab one of these, okay. just pick one Nikki, off. It looks, it looks like a rock. There you go, Nikki. And you can keep the big one, Donnie. That's for you. There you go. And what we're going to do is we're going to break these open. Now, in the stores, these are $24, and we're making them at home for, once again, under a dollar. Just crack it open. Yes. Break it yeah, open, and you'll see there treasures. are secret treasures, treasures inside of these. Oh. Just give it a break. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Look at this. Isn't that awesome? Stars and jewelry. Absolutely. Let me show you how to, how to make it. There you and go. I, and if you notice, everything in Donnie's treasure stone looks like it's a certain color. It's all purple. Oh. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. I get it. It's all purple. So we'll start right here. Oh, it's, no, I got to tell you, it smells like coffee. Well, actually, there's coffee in there. That is our secret ingredient. What we've started with, if you want to help us out over there, we have one cup of flour in the bowl. Okay. Add to that. Just add the coffee grounds to it. That's okay. one cup of used coffee grounds. Okay. And then a half cup of salt and a quarter cup of sand. Okay. Mix the, all that in together along with that cup of water. Okay. And then just stir it. After you stir That's it, all you it do. turns into this dough. So just pull a clump out. Everybody just grab a clump here. You and it's, and it's becomes there? There, hard it cool? like a rock. And then we're going to choose our secret yeah, treasure to go in this treasure stone. So just grab a treasure. Mm -hmm. Oh, you yeah. mean we're going to make yeah, this? Yeah, take your treasure. I've take got your dough. Tito. <laughs> make it into a ball. Okay. And then make a little indentation for your treasure to fit into. Okay. Just like that. Wrap it around the treasure. Okay. And then what you're going to want to do is let it bake in the sun until it's hard. Oh, you don't have to put it in an oven or anything. You, you can just... put it in the oven at like 120 oh, degrees. Just put about, it in the sun. Yeah, for about right. 20 minutes. We'll put, put it on the sun. sun. It will air dry. And when okay. you're finished, cool? you have a treasure stone. Okay. For okay. Well, what, what a great what, idea for birthday parties. Isn't yeah. that fun? Yeah. What, is, what is this party? gooey stuff this, here? Well, actually, you can reach in there and pick it out. Here, everybody wants to pull it all out. Just pull it out. Reach in there. Grab a hole. That's like a gooey dunk. Here, exactly. Look at this out. Gooey and gooey. I want and, some uh, more. <laughs> you want some that of this? Like I got <laughs> some suckers. He's still in the place. He's still oh, he's putting the treasure in. <laughs> Nikki, <laughs> fill this. Fill it. It's so gooey. Cool? You Isn't like that? that? Awesome? <laughs> but once again, <laughs> he's got a smile on that one. <laughs> This is household ingredients. How do you make and this? What, just start right here. One cup of regular school glue. And to that, just add that cup of water for me, would you please? Okay. You just... And a few drops of that green food coloring. Okay. Just pour all that in there. See how easy and this stir is? it up. Stir that up. <laughs> Over drops. here. Yeah, well, not the whole thing, Marie. <laughs> Over here, I have one and one third cups of warm water. Okay. And to that, we're going to add just three teaspoons of Borax Laundry Booster. No this you can no. buy in the store. It's just a laundry product. It's awesome. a whitener, brighter. Right. Absolutely. Right. Now so what cheap. we're going to do is, once that's stirred up, pour that solution into here. Yep. Ah! Wait, <laughs> here, I'll pour it. And I'll wait till you see what happens. Watch this. This is yeah. instantly. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Instantly. That is so cool. To a job. Oh. Oh. Is that cool? All right. Knead it for about 60 seconds. And it what, what are these? These we call spongy balls in the stores. They're, they're how much? About fourteen ninety five. We're yes. going to show you once again how to make them under a dollar. And okay. these are just like regular sponges that you buy. And you what do you cut Absolutely. them up? Absolutely right. cheap sponges yeah, are we'll probably aren't good for, for anything else but making spongy balls. There. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> what what you need is doing here is we have it's amazing what a sponge can do to somebody. You know, <laughs> she's so excited about a sponge. <laughs> What, what we have are really three really cheap sponges, and we cut each sponge into thirds, and then we're just going to stack them up. 
Yeah, now these sponges we got at the dollar store, this? three for a dollar. So, uh -huh. like I said, this project's under a dollar. Oh, you, what do you want to do with that? In the bowl if you want. Can you put it right there in the bowl, Nikki? <laughs> Thank you. Okay, now what we're do waiting. I do with this? <laughs> Our next ingredient is just a cable tie. This is just something you get at the electronic department. You can buy a pack of 100 for about a dollar. They're real inexpensive. And just give it, give it a big twist. Grab it in the middle. And then put it on the top of the cable tie. And this is a quickie, the tricky part. Yeah, you want to center it over and the cable tie. And then pour that tie. over there. And then just push that right through there. Oh, like those little cables. Yeah, there bars. you go. Pull it really tight. And there you got it. And you have, there you have it, a spongy ball. Now That's what it. we've done over here is I've actually Cut taken and made smaller versions and oh, attached rubber bands. Here, oh, take yeah. some of these. Yeah, and oh, what here, you can do is you can shoot these. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what would be a blast? <laughs> is to take these and like get them wet and like in a swimming pool. Yeah. Oh, that sure. would be cool. <laughs> that would be cool. Okay, what? Wet. Speaking of getting wet, those are water balloons. Yeah, these are actually here. Take one. These are a little tricky when you start. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if we're do that or not. Here, let me have one. Let okay. me have one. Would you like one? No, just give it. Just hand <laughs> it to me. I'd love to give you one. Just give. Just hand it to me. <laughs> And okay. what I've done here is it's just a balloon, a quarter of the way full with Look water. How cool that is. Fill the rest of it with air, tie on a rubber band, make a loop at one end, and that's all there is to yeah. it. You have a water balloon yo yo. That's cool. Yeah. Isn't that easy? Here! Who wants this? Oh. 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 See, that's what's cool about it. That's what's cool about it is that uh, it doesn't break. No. I have to say, you're that's testing cool. these beyond what we've ever had. Okay, what do we have here, finally? I say the audience over there needs one. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> and we don't break. What's the last this is thing our, our final project, which is a classic concoction, paper mache paste. What we have here is just a quarter <laughs> cup of uh, flour, mix one cup water. of water. Mix that together, mm -hmm. then pour it into five cups of boiling hot water. So mom okay. or dad's going to want right. to help out with exactly. this. Mix it together. So you have it there. Mixed. Yeah, mix yeah. it together. Yeah. This is what it looks like, and we're going to make a pinata. We start off oh, with just cool. a, just a so balloon, balloon, and we're going to want to dip in these little pieces uh, of newspaper, just regular right. newspaper. You just, just keep putting on there, layers of right. that on. Yeah. Marie, and when you're finished, you have that, and just pop the balloon on the inside. So then you There's a pair of scissors. Yeah, just pop it. Hold that for me, Marie. Oh, there we go. And then you want to decorate it and fill it with candy it's or alive. toys. <laughs> it's, 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 it's a lot of Now, I understand you brought one with you. We actually have one, and I, I think you we put, should break it open. What do you think? I want to break it open. Yeah. Let's break it open. Let's see what's inside. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you ready? Everybody's <laughs> up. <laughs> okay, you ready? Cool. This is a fun yo yo. Oh, okay, fun yo yo. Oh. oh, give me one more shot. <laughs> Nikki, thank you, you so much. If you want to do this at home, get the ultimate book of kids' concoctions, and we'll be right back. This is a fabulous Thank book. you. Nikki, we borrowed him for this little segment here. You see, our next guests have found a terrific way to turn common household items into children's crafts. That's it's really cool. That's right. They've even written a book about it. It's called The Ultimate Book of Kid Concoctions. Will you please welcome John Thomas and Anita Pagel. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Appreciate it. How are you?